Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks and somebody, and this is this is the kind of video I love to make. It's so easy, so simple, and so quick. And just for your information, the one I'm doing it for, um, you can't really have two circles inside of a circle because it's going to fall out. Once you cut this circle, the other circle is going to be gone. So that's, you need to think about that. Now, this wagon wheel is made up of lines. His nudge factor, ironically, was already on 14 inches. Now, I, I'm, your colors are CMYK, so you really need to make them RGB if, if you're a laser engraver, which I'm thinking you are. So I'm going to use a smart fill tool. I'm going to fill that in. I'm going to nudge it over using my left arrow key. I'm going to left click, right click. You can't round the corners of these lines, but you can round the corner now. So if you'll go to Windows, Dockers, and Corners, you can do them all at the same time, and it's already it's already showing you what it's going to look like at point two circles. Now this is rounding all three corners. If that if that works, that's fine. If it's not, grab your shape tool and grab the two you want to round over, and then hit apply, and it will only do those two corners. Or if you only want that corner. You just hit apply, and it'll only round that one. But if you want all four corners, all been a long day, long three quarter, three corners, then that's all you have to do. And then just nudge these lines out of the way. And there's really, and now that I think about it, there's another way to do this. You hit, uh, nudge it back over. And instead of doing that the other times, and it looks like he drew in the center of the page. Just let's double check with the indexing line. And sure enough, he drew in the center of the page. So what we could do is just get rid of all these lines. And what we could do there is just take and nudge that main circle out of the way. And since we're not grabbing the whole outer circle, we can just hit delete. This one's a little bit harder, but we can grab it and hit delete. And then grab these two and hit delete because we're not grabbing that. Nudge this back over, actually just hit P, take this and control D and make it do. Okay, that's the only problem you've got. You need such your nudge, well, it looks like you've been playing with it, so it might be, you might not, uh, you want to set this on zero, zero. Uh, and this is the exact reason why. So when you do this and then set your, rotation to the center. A lot of time done a little look at it is. And I don't now I don't remember how many there was, but we can go 72 and that wasn't it. So let's go I didn't count how many wagon wheels there were. Control D and make it 90 degrees nail or how many spokes there were. And you're done. A little bit quicker than doing this on all of them. Uh, but think about that center axle, uh, that's going to fall out. I hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.